Having carefully considered the data and consulted with local public health officials, local authorities and Police Scotland, all of uh, whom were involved in the resilience meeting discussion that has just taken place, I can therefore confirm this evening that we have decided to take the following action. Uh, from midnight tonight, if you live in local authority areas of East Renfrewshire, uh, the city of Glasgow or Western Bartonshire, you should not host people from other households in your home and you should not visit someone else's home, no matter where that is. The only exception to that, apart from obviously in emergencies or to provide care for a vulnerable person, uh, relates to the extended households that were established during lockdown, when people who lived alone, couples who do not live together, or parents uh, who live alone with children under 18 could join with one other household to provide mutual support. Aye, testing, testing, testing. All right, folks, welcome back to Glasgow News. Right, that was a bold Nicola just informing you that... Um, you know, Glasgow is back in lockdown. And I'm on the mail here. And it says, Glasgow wakes to a new lockdown. Nicola Sturgeon enforces restrictions on cities 800,000 people and nearby regions after a spike in COVID cases with measures to last at least 14 days. All right. 14 days. That seems to be something that's popping up all the time, isn't it, this 14-day thing? So what is it What is it that's changed, though? Because I remember way back in May, yeah, it was the 28th of May 2020, it said, um, I remember it says, here we are, coronavirus Scottish lockdown easing to begin on Friday. People in Scotland will be able to meet their friends and family outside from Friday. Uh, people from two different households will be able to meet but these new rules, right, these new rules are saying exactly the opposite. We're back to square one, aren't we? It says here, three designated areas should not be hosting anyone from another household. Oh, I've been here before. What is it? What is it that's causing this, folks? Have you got a clue at all? Well, the clue lies in the incubation period, I believe, for the coronavirus. You know, on average, it says the symptoms showed up in a newly infected person after about five days. Rarely, symptoms appeared as soon as two days. But most people with symptoms had it had them by day 12. All right, that's nearly two weeks, that's a fortnight. And in most other people, uh, they were sick by day 14. There's that 14 day thing. See what I'm saying, folks? So, what else has been happening? Well, as you know, there was an incident in Dundee in Dundee, and I'm on the mail online here, it says a huge COVID outbreak shuts a Dundee school as 17 staff and two pupils test positive. Just two weeks after classes restarted in Scotland, all staff and children at King's Park School in Dundee, Scotland have now have to, will now have to self-isolate after the outbreak. That's ominous, isn't it? And there was also um, a report that said what was most concerning are reports of outbreaks among school students. Eight pupils at Barnum and High School in Glasgow have tested positive, although that school's reopened last week. That's a powder keg there. You, you know you can't really control kids. I, I will say, though, I will say that in between all this happening, the Dundee outbreak and what's happened to Glasgow here, there's been advice for school kids to be wearing masks. At the very beginning when they went back, they were saying there's no need for masks, so maybe that will have an effect, right? Because that looks like the future for kids in schools. But, you know, the epidemiologists, I think this is why Nicola Sturgeon is our, our, our most frightening uh, period for her, because she knows that the, the, the country needs to open up. We must go back to work. These kids must get back to school, right? They're going crazy in the house with her mom and dad and all that, you know? You know, um, running about the streets. Um, but most, e most of the worldwide epidemiologists have commented, and you might not have been aware of it, that one of the, the things that helped us get this R number, this, this elusive R number down, was that all the educational institutions in the country shut down. And that's what actually created a big um, drop 
in the transmission of the virus. The fact that schools, nurseries, colleges and universities shut down actually helped bring it down. And one of the things that they're reopening here is the schools. And it's no any coincidence that 14 days after the Scottish schools were sent back, you know, said Scottish schools to fully open the 11th of August, where well, we're just at the end of August, just over 14 days in Glasgow has been shut down. Are you starting to get the picture? And what is that picture? What is it I'm trying to say? Well, what I'm trying to say is that the virus is spreading again, right? And it's spreading because of the schools are open. Now, what you've got to understand is the schools act like an amplifier, like the signal, the virus hits the schools and it's amplified out because all those kids go straight back home. They're not washing their hands. They just go straight back home, etc. They're getting their dinner and all that and they're giving it to their parents. And then it's going to start hitting the parents at work. And it's going to start hitting the grannies and the granders and etc. Here we go. Right. So what do you take for this? Well, what you take for this is this isn't over. This is by no means over. Winter is coming, folks. It's no, do it's no all doom and gloom. By this stage, you know how to take precautions. What you need to do is maintain all these same rules that you made for yourself. Cleaning. Make sure you're wearing masks. Make sure your kids wear masks. Make sure they clean their hands. Make sure your kids have got hand cleaner. Make sure they understand what's actually happening. Make sure they know that schools can amplify the virus. I think they get it, right? They know. But they need to... You need to reinforce the hand cleaning thing. You need to reinforce all of that. And in fact, yourselves, when you go out shopping, maintain that. That's why, why do you think they've made it nearly a law to wear a mask outside? They kind of slipped up with the school thing. Right, I don't know where she was getting her advice. But she slipped up there. Uh, and now all kids have to wear masks. You see, they're no invulnerable, these people. They make mistakes. You get some guy going, no, I don't think it'll be, I don't think you'll need kids to wear masks. Bang. Shut the school down. Dundee. Boom. There you go. Take that. Shut it down. So, you know, keep the faith and we'll get there. You know, I was going to just about to go on a rant there about the Chinese Communist Party. <laughs> but I'm going to leave it, folks, for now. So, don't be surprised, though, if we get to a stage where Glasgow school closures... That might happen. It's very likely to happen. Right? To try and get a handle on it. And reset. Because the damage might have been done within the 14 days. You see? See, we are 14 days. We are two weeks ahead of England. If they do not do the mask thing in their schools, it's going to be chaos down there. It's going to be cities, schools, districts, all shutting down all over the place. But watch. Within... Before the end of September, I predict that there's going to be chaos in certain areas of England because of the no masks in schools. And then they will reset after it stabilises. Anyway, folks, it's not meant to frighten you. It's meant to drum home the reality of where we are. You know, as I said, winter is coming. We all get the cold, the flu, sniffs and sneezes, and the virus loves that environment. So we have to be uh, doubly certain that we've got all the facilities in the house to uh, make sure the kids are safe and make sure you're safe. Anyway, folks, if you like the content, hit the like button, share and subscribe because um, that's all I've got to say about that. How dare you!